So now, this is the 80s and you're, you're gaining momentum. Parang hindi matatapos to. Everything is just coming in. Everything you touch is magic, blah, 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 and all that stuff. And then someone does uh, uh, an imitation of Michael Jackson and now Gary Valenciano is in town. Yes. That was actually the best thing that happened to me. Really? Well, you don't have Jollibee without McDonald's. McDonald's right. And you don't have McDonald's without Jollibee. And now, now the audience that I thought was all mine <laughs> is now split in half. <laughs> but the good news for them was we have something else. Right. Not that same. Be exactly, lady. right? Very opposite. Very opposite and very welcome to the music industry. We needed some sort of a change. So now you and so now you and Gary were here. Sabay kayo kumakit. Kumbaga, ang tingin ko sa inyo parang William Gabby eh. May William Martinez. May Gabby Concepcion. I just want to know who's Gabby. I just want to know which one of us do you think was Gabby. I just want to know. Oh nga, sino nga? Um, ako, I think you were Gabby. <laughs> Kasi makulit si William, makulit si... Si, si, si on si, stage. Oh, ha, Pero alam mo, we learned because Gary and I work together lately a lot together. I'm, he's more makulit than me. Literally. I mean, he's just, you don't see it on stage because he's so protected. Yeah, prim and proper. He's so protected. That, that's the only word I can think of. He's always behind this, this facade that I know it's not him. He, he's the best jokes. Talaga? He has the best, you don't even know. He has the best punchlines. He'll say to me, bro, bro. And, he'll, <laughs> and I start cracking up. I said, why don't you say it on stage? Say it. No, you na lang, bro. You na lang. <laughs> hey, wala na. Wala na yung oras. Tapos na yung joke. <laughs> but yeah, that Gary, when we were, when we were, we were actually rivals for a while. We literally rivals. Literally, because can you can you cuento to us? Well, because the fans before, if you back in the day, and now Very possessive is it fans. following now or hits? What do you call it now? Whatever it's followers. called, followers. Followers. Our followers then were real people. I mean, physical people you could see and touch, uh, and and. Um, I thought I had enough right. to not be insecure of this new guy. But when he came along and started wiggling and wobbling on stage, move your body. He left me in the dust. You, you, you felt that? Of course. But you know what? Even back then, I was rooting for him because we became friends. Pero time out. Pero going back, don't you think Martin's rage, Martin's rage Play the part in yeah, discipline. I'm not going to go there because I already went there with rage and it did not work. I stick to my guns. Yes, and let Gary be Gary. Did Did you feel that more than ever when Gary came? We went the complete opposite way, which is the way I started. Right, right. Tama right. ka when yung pinalit ka yung image ko, male, male. I should not have done that. <laughs> so when I went back to the old me and found that I could do television and things like that, somehow without even trying. Nag branch out coming dalawa ni Gary. He, so he was yeah. only responsible for his following and me for mine. Right. For, for me, for me, and him for him. Not because of him, not because of me. Only to find out that I think both, I, I don't know if I can speak for Gary, because of our, our rivalry before, because, and it, the rivalry ruined our friendship. We were really good friends. In the beginning. We would hang out in his house. Uh-huh. He showed me, pa, I have your cassette. I had a cassette already at that time. You get on coming, nag- yeah, nag- yeah, usap, yeah. Usap, talking about what we want to become, how we want to be, showing what we, our, our autographs, how we'll sign when we become big so, stars. Before you were big stars, but kasama na kayo. Friends na kami. I don't, and I don't even know why. I know why, pala, because we were always in the same. Yung mga shows, Mary No. Oh, yeah, yung mga variety show. A variety show. <laughs> who'll play last? Who'll play? Exactly. Who's going to play last? Who's going to play last? <laughs> And last means midnight yeah. or yeah, yeah, something. Yeah, yeah. Not who's going to play last because you're the bigger star. Right, right, right. I want to go home already. <laughs> Parang ganon. So, meron kaming ganon. So, it, it, it started there, the friendship. We'd hang out with each other. And then we became rivals. And it started with an article that came out where it said here, Sino sa tatlo o magiging tatay? Sino yung pangatlo? Do you remember that or no? You were not born yet. You too. You definitely. Um... It was Martin, uh-huh. Raymond Lauchenko, or Gary V. Okay. So who of the three are going to become? That's where, it, oh my God. How did we get into the picture? Diba? Kami ni Raymond. Because it was Gary who was going to become yeah. a, a father. So uh, it started there because then everyone started blaming <laughs> the other for revealing the secret to this reporter that he's going to be a 
I said, I don't, and, and Gary, owned, he told me that secret. Right. He goes, bro, I got to tell you something. And so he thought I was the one who started the rumor. That's how bad the rivalry was before. Siempre. Uh, you number one rival ni Gary, si Martin. So si yeah. Martin, nag, nag, re, no, absolutely oh, not. Man, oh, oh, absolutely. Yeah. If anything, when it comes to things as serious that, as that, you shut your mouth. Yeah. Diba? All bets are off. Between guys, kahit comp- competitors, kid, that's the worst. Now, if Gary V went off in a concert out of tune, ayan. Baka pwede si Martin yun. Or if, oh, Martin, yeah. if Martin fell off the stage and Gary and he came out, baka si Gary yun. Pero yung mga personal na... Ma- bawal. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know about these days, but back then, bawal. Hindi na kayo nag-uusap ni Mr. Pure Energy, Gary V. You miss him. But before we talk about you guys getting back together, did... You guys being separated help in terms of your career by helping you just focus on you and not knowing what the other is doing. Uh, on the contrary, we watched, we studied each other. Ah. We knew exactly what the other was doing, so we did the opposite. Okay. You get me? So, kung gagawin ni Gary ng kunyari, music museum, Martin will do a, a venue a little bigger. Right. Then Gary will see that I'm in, in a bigger thing. He'll go to the Araneta. If I did Ultra, he was Araneta. If I was Araneta, he was Ganon. So it really helped. And the market was growing. In fact, a lot of artists that followed us benefited from this because yes. now you know the gauge of success back in the day, not now, was how big your size meant everything back right. then. How big your venue is. We know that that doesn't hold true anymore. You can do a show right here in your garage and still have the same amount of people and m- amount of success. It doesn't matter anymore, but back then it was everything. Paano kayo nakabati ni Gary Valenciano? You want to know the truth? I'll tell you how. Because in the 90s, which is the, t- the, the decade you forgot to talk about, yeah, no, no, I, there was a time it. when Gary V and I were equal. You know why? Why? Because there were... That was the era of the bands. I wasn't going there yet. I'm going there because we hated you guys. <laughs> Intro Voice, River Maya, Eraser Heads, True, True, True Faith. Faith yeah. True Faith. And now after we, Image. Yeah. After Image. I mean, The Dawn, just to name a few of the bands that took over. I'll never forget. This is the truth. I'm in Loyola. Ateneo. Yes. Loyola doing a concert. Mary Noel has eraser heads. Now try and guess how many people watched the concert king of the Philippines. Just take a guess. Less half? Not even 200 people. Loyola, you know how big Loyola yes, is? Yes, okay. that, that whole, yeah. Now the 200 people, I think, I think were part of the class that produced <laughs> us. So actually nobody came. Ask me how many people watch the Eraser Heads. Intro voice, ganun din. Yeah. When all the screaming girls went to the bands, na wala, na even Steven, sila Martin and Gary. Nagiging even, dun kami naga, ano, we're playing cards. <laughs> na, nagmama dyong kami dalawa ni Gary. Ano, ano, ponga, 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 ponga. Gary, Gary, ali, ali, ali. Ponga, ponga, ponga. That was the time Gary V and I ate humble pie. We just became, you know, referred to as, you know, how about a Martin Rivera song? That's all we were. Oh my a God. A song, a history, a peg. But we were in the dust, eating the dust of the likes of the intro voice. But you know, I was going to go there. I was going to go there. Actually, see Dave, kung ayung. Okay, I just said, in the night, no, 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 80s, because we're saving the 90s. I for- didn't know you were saving it. Thank you for saving the best for last. Well, you win. <laughs> no. <laughs> Because, <laughs> because nakakatuwa nga talaga. Because kami ni na JJ, sabi namin, ang goal namin was to be like you guys, pero in a band setting. Because not everybody can sing like Martin Rivera, not everybody can sing like Gary Valenciano. But we wanted to be as popular as you guys and all you that were. stuff. You did, and then some. <laughs> so, sabi namin, at least if we do this collectively, isang tao lang yun, baka kaya natin. You know, we tried. Well, I'm sure you also had your, your, I mean, if we had more time, I would ask you about your competition with all the other bands. What did Intro Voice have that, let's say, the Eraserheads didn't have? What was your calling? I mean, I'm sure you also Friendship. liked each other. What is it? Friendship. <laughs> <laughs> no, but yeah, that's true. I keep telling that people. That happens. Yes. <laughs> that really happens. I, I know. You guys are still together. Yeah. every no, Originally together. So, 
ang, ang competition was, we were more like the Martin Nivera. Mm, how so? Kami yung mga baladir. Okay, okay. Kami, do namin nakuha yung tao. Just be, <laughs> just be, you know that. And then, siguro, the pure energy, yun na yung mga nagra-rock. Iko-compare na natin sa mga Gary Valenciano uh. style, di ba? But, your formula, sabi namin, kaya natin to eh. Si Jonathan has a very distinct voice. Not mm-hmm. the best voice, but distinct voice like you. But when you hear it, you know it's intro voice. Mm. When you hear my voice, you know it's Martin. That's what you mean. Yes, distinct, di ba? Like sabi ko, people can sing a Martin Rivera song, but they don't sound like Martin. So we have that with Jonathan. But Jonathan can't talk. <laughs> That's where I come in. Ako, I can talk like Martin. But, I mean, I'm no Martin, but at least I can, I can, you know, I have the gift of gab In too. other words, madaldal. Oh. Just so you know, okay. So, sabi ko, oh, dito tayo, sundan natin ang formula ni Martin. So that's what we did. Oh, see? So I, I'm glad to help. Thank you very yes, much. Yes, yes. <laughs> yes, very, no, very true. That's why it's, it's, it's here, it's nice that you're here, that Robin's here, because when I first met Robin as a musician, ang goal namin was to really return that favor. Really? Thank you. Kumbaga, papunta pa lang siya to do wish, kami mababakap sa kanya sa intro voice, sabi namin, let's do justice to Robin Rivera. 